Hi, I'm Jeff Eckert. I'm a psychologist here at Roots. I'm here to talk to you today a little bit about an anxiety reduction technique known as hand over heart. This technique is one that I use a lot in my work with people just to help calm and soothe our systems in a world that feels really unsteady, uncertain. Uh, it just feels good to have something that when we sit down and do this, we can feel some sense of calm and some sense of peace that we don't really know how to find elsewhere. Um, there's some science behind this technique that I want to share to start out with. So we all have some uh, hormones in our body that get released at various times. The first one is we're going to talk about is one called cortisol. Uh, Cortisol is a hormone that gets released in the midst of stress. We all have it. It gets released in every one of us. But when we have lots of stress, we get lots of cortisol release. So when you start to feel tired and achy and your joints ache after a lot of stress, a lot of that is because of that cortisol release just washing over your body in a way that has impact on your whole system. And you just feel tired and you feel heavy and you don't feel great. So. There is another hormone in the body that's a great antidote to cortisol, and it's known as oxytocin. Oxytocin is often called the love hormone because it really often gets released in the midst of a safe, loving, connected relationship, particularly around touch. There are receptors in the body that release oxytocin in the midst of healthy appropriate touch in relationships with people and a sense of healthy connection with others. So we're going to do an exercise where we do some oxytocin release today. So another thing to know is a lot of the neurons in the body that, that stimulate the release of oxytocin are found right around the heart, which is interesting when we think about it being the love hormone. So what I'd like you to do to start out with is just to take your hand and place it over your heart and start taking some breaths in, three counts, and out, three counts, in and out, just feeling what's going on in your body and noticing as you breathe in and breathe out, trying to notice what's going on physically in your body and noticing Maybe a little greater sense of calm as you breathe in and you breathe out. Now, I'd like you to think about a time when you felt particularly cared for or particularly nurtured by someone. So it could be a friend, a family member, any time that really feels nurturing and caring. And you have an image of that that you can hold on to as you breathe in and you breathe out. Thinking about that time and noticing what that feels like. To think through when someone cared for you, when someone did something to love you well. And when you're practicing this, probably doing it for two or three minutes would be sufficient. There have been some studies that have been done around hand over heart showing that if this is done on a consistent basis, that over the period of about a month of doing it daily for two to three minutes, they've seen blood pressure drop by a point or two. And they've also shown in people who have panic disorder that if this is done early on in the anxiety cycle, when you're just starting to feel that anxiety, that it can help stave off a panic attack. So it's a very powerful tool. It's very soothing and can give you that sense of peace and sense of rest in a world where those things are often fleeting and difficult and hard to find. Thanks so much for your time today, and I hope you find this a place of calm and peace in this harried world.